the Andromeda system played an urgent role in reshaping how we might interpret the universe, testing the idea that Earth held a central position in vast issues. It was a turning point, highlighting that the Milky Way, our home galaxy, was only one of innumerable others thrown across the vast region of space. Advances in observational technology, especially the array of instruments like the James Webb Space Telescope, have allowed us to peer further into the universe, unraveling the mysteries of Andromeda. However, recent discoveries from data captured by the James Webb Telescope have challenged many long-held beliefs about this neighboring galaxy. Many years ago, the prevailing view of the Milky Way was that of a faint, diffuse band of light stretching across the night sky. This perception, influenced by the limited technological capabilities of the time, hindered astronomers' ability to identify individual stars within our galaxy. Instead, various beliefs persisted, often associating the Milky Way with the center of creation where the divine and earthly realms converged. It was not until the 17th century that our perception of the Milky Way underwent a revolutionary change, courtesy of Galileo Galilei and his pioneering work with a telescope. Using the 100-inch Hooker telescope at the Mount Wilson Observatory, Hubble identified distant nebulae beyond the Milky Way, demonstrating that they were galaxies in their own right, each containing billions of stars. Among these galaxies was the Andromeda Galaxy, or M31, one of the closest to our own. Andromeda's history of observation dates back centuries, with records of its presence found as far back as the 10th century, when the Persian astronomer ABD Al-Rahman al-Sufi described it as a small cloud. Despite the lack of telescopic instruments, al-Sufi's sharp observational skills allowed him to identify Andromeda as a celestial object separate from the familiar stars dotting the night sky. Detailed observations of Andromeda began vigorously in 1612 when Simon Marius provided a more thorough description based on telescopic observations. Later, in 1764, Charles Messier listed Andromeda as M31, mistakenly attributing its discovery solely to Marius and overlooking al-Sufi's earlier identification. Significant strides in understanding Andromeda were made in 1864, when English astronomer William Huggins made groundbreaking observations further clarifying the nature of this complex galaxy. Andromeda, despite its immense size, is estimated to have a mass between one and two trillion times that of our Sun. This colossal cosmic structure, residing relatively close to us in the expanse of space, has fascinated scientists for ages. With an estimated age of around 10 billion years, Andromeda is considered ancient in cosmic terms indicating a rich history of formation and evolution. One intriguing aspect of Andromeda's origin is the hypothesis that it formed through the merger of several smaller protogalaxies over billions of years. Andromeda's physical properties, however, remain a point of contention among astronomers. With a diameter of approximately 220,000 light-years, Andromeda surpasses the Milky Way in size. Its vast dimensions make it a significant cosmic entity occupying a large region of space. The complexities involved in accurately measuring the mass of galaxies underscore the challenges of studying these vast cosmic structures. Galaxies are intricate systems, and their mass is intricately linked to the distribution and movement of stars, gas, dust, and dark matter within them. This necessitates advanced observational techniques and meticulous analysis which were not available until modern times. One of the most captivating features of Andromeda is its active galactic nucleus, a highly energetic region at the galaxy's center powered by a supermassive black hole. Observations with advanced telescopes like the Hubble Space Telescope have revealed fascinating phenomena within the Andromeda nucleus, including two points of focus where emissions are more intense than in surrounding areas. These observations shed light on the dynamic processes occurring at the heart of Andromeda and enhance our understanding of galactic nuclei. The supermassive black hole at the center of the Andromeda galaxy exerts enormous gravitational influence, with its mass estimated to range from 1.1 to 2.3 multiplied by 10 to the power of 8 solar masses, or approximately 110 to 230 million times the mass of our Sun. Supermassive black holes are believed to be common features at the centers of galaxies including our own Milky Way, and their presence significantly shapes the evolution and dynamics of these cosmic structures. When matter like gas and stars ventures too close to a supermassive black hole, it forms an accretion disk around it. 
This disk of swirling material heats up and emits intense radiation across various wavelengths, contributing to the luminosity of the galactic nucleus. Ring galaxies are considered rare cosmic phenomena, with only approximately 1 in 10,000 galaxies classified as such. Astronomers have proposed two primary mechanisms for the formation of ring galaxies. Firstly, they can form through the collision of two or more galaxies. Alternatively, a smaller galaxy passing through the center of a larger galaxy can trigger the formation of a ring-like structure. Examples of ring galaxies thought to have formed through galactic collisions include the Cartwheel Galaxy, PGC 2248, and ARP 147, showcasing the complex interplay of cosmic elements.